Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Today discussing the one of the important topic in intermediate in straight lines, orthocentro. This topic is very important for our final examinations. Now, what is the orthocentro? So, orthocentro is concurrency point of altitudes is called orthocentro. So, what are the altitudes? The perpendicular drawn from the vertex to the opposite side of a triangle is called altitude of a triangle. Altitude means height of the triangle. The altitudes of a triangle are concurrent. The point of concurrence is called orthocenter of a triangle. It is denoted by capital O. So, what is the altitudes? The line drawn from the vertex to opposite side perpendicular. So, here AD bar perpendicular to BC bar and BE bar perpendicular to AC bar and CF bar perpendicular to AB bar. So, your point of concurrence is called orthocenter. It is denoted by O. Now, here one of the special case in right angle triangle orthocenter lies at right angle vertex. In orthocenter of a right angle triangle is a vertex containing the right angle. In right angle triangle orthocenter lies at right angle vertex. Okay. Now discussing the one or two problems related to orthocenter. These problems are very important to your final examinations. Now, first question. Find the orthocenter of a triangle whose vertices are A of minus 2 comma minus 1, B of 6 comma minus 1 and C of 2 comma 5. Here are two conditions. First one, A over bar perpendicular to BC bar. Next one, the altitude drawn from B perpendicular to AC. If two lines are perpendicular, then product of slopes equal to minus 1. You know the condition? If two lines are perpendicular, then product of slopes equal to minus 1. Next, what is slope of the line passing through the two points y2 minus y1 by x2 minus x1? Now, your solution. Let us consider. Let us consider O of x comma y b a ortho center ortho center of a triangle a b c. There are two conditions. First one O a bar means the altitude passing through the a vertex and ortho center which is perpendicular to opposite side BC bar. If two lines are perpendicular, then product of their slopes equal to minus 1. Then product of their slopes means slope of OA bar into slope of BC bar equal to minus 1 product of the slopes equal to minus 1. What is the slope of the two points y2 minus y1 by x2 minus x1? So, yeah, first one, slope of the OA bar. Uh, product of the slopes equal to minus 1. Here, A point x1 y1. Here, O point x2 y2. Now, applying the slope formula, m equal to y2 minus y1 by x2 minus x1. Yeah, slope of the OA bar first, y2 minus y1, y minus of minus 1 y2 minus y1 means y minus of minus means plus 1 by your x2 minus x1 x minus of minus plus x plus 2 into bc bar so your bc bar so slope of the bc bar this is the x1 y1 this is the x2 y2 y2 minus y1 by x2 minus x1 5 minus of minus plus 1 by 2 minus 6. 
equal to minus 1. Product of the slopes equal to minus 1. Now simplify the equation. This is the y plus 1 by x plus 2 into 5 plus 1, 6 by 2 minus 6, minus 4 equal to minus 1. Now here, now here minus minus cancel. Next, 2 3s are 2 2s are. Here, numerator value is 3 times of y plus 1 by denominator value is 2 times of x plus 2 equal to right hand side value is 1. Now we are taking the cross multiplication. 3 of y plus 1 equal to 2 of x plus 2. We are taking the cross multiplications. 3 of y plus 1 equal to 2 of x plus 2. Now simplify the equation 3 into y. 3y three plus 3 1 are 3 equal to 2 into x, 2x plus 2 to the 4. Now, this left hand side terms transform to right hand side. 2x plus 4, here plus 3y become the minus 3y. Plus 3 transpose to right hand side to get the minus 3 equal to 0. Now, here 2x minus 3y plus 1 equal to 0. This is the equation number 1. Okay. So, what is your first condition? OA perpendicular to BC. If two lines are perpendicular, then product of slopes equal to minus 1. What is slope of the line passing through the two points? Y2 minus Y1 by X2 minus X1. Now, simplify the equation. To get the your equation, first equation, 2X minus 3Y plus 1 equal to 0. Okay. Now, second. Now, your second one. OB bar, the altitude drawn from B, this is passing through the ortho center. OB bar, perpendicular to opposite side, AC bar. The second one, OB bar, perpendicular to AC bar. If two lines are perpendicular, then product of their slopes equal to minus 1. Slope of OB bar into slope of AC bar equal to minus 1. Now here, two point slope formula y2 minus y1 by x2 minus x1. Now here, OB bar slope. OB bar slope y2 minus y1 by x2 minus x1. Here, y2 value y minus of minus plus y plus 1 by x minus 6. y2 minus y1 by x2 minus x1 into Slope of AC bar, AC bar, this is the C point X1, Y1, this is X2, Y2. So, Y2 minus Y1 by 5 minus of minus plus 1 by 2 minus of minus plus 2 equal to minus 1. Now, here Y plus 1 by X minus 6 into 5 plus 1 value 6. Their value y plus 1 by x minus 6 into 6 by 4 equal to minus 1. So, at cancellations, 2 3s are 2 2s. Now, in numerator value is 3 of y plus 1, denominator value is 2 of x minus 6. Now, simplify the equation 3 of y plus 1 by 2 of x minus 6 equal to minus 1. Now multiply with 3. 3y three plus 3 by 2x minus 12 equal to minus 1. Now taking the cross multiplication to get the value 3y plus 3 equal to minus 1 into 2x minus 12. Now here 3y plus 3 equal to minus 1 into 2x minus 2x minus into minus plus 1 12 is 12. Now, here right hand side terms transform to left hand side minus 2x become the plus 2x plus 12 become the minus 12. Now, here minus 2x become the plus 2x plus 3y plus 3 
here plus 12 become the minus 12 equal to 0. Now simplify the equation 2x plus 3y minus 9 equal to 0. This is the equation number 2. Now solving the equation number 1 and 2 to get the x and y values. These x and y values are coordinate points of ortho center of the triangle x comma y. Now solving the equation number 1 and 2. Here solving the equation number 1 and 2 by using the cross multiplication method. So this is the first equation. This is the second equation. Now you are taking the order B, C, A, B means y coefficient, constant, x coefficient and y coefficient. In first equation y coefficient minus 3, constant 1, x coefficient 2, y coefficient minus 3. In second equation y coefficient 3, constant minus 9, x coefficient 2, y coefficient 3, x, y, 1. Now your x by taking the cross multiplication minus into minus plus 3 9 is 27. Next 3 1 is 3 means you are taking the minus 3. You know the debt of 2 by 2 matrix A B C D your A D minus B C. Second time taking the minus extra. So your plus 3 become the minus 3 equal to y by 1 2 is 2. Minus 9 into 2 minus 18 here minus 18 become the plus 18 equal to 1 by 2 3 is a 6 and 2 into minus 3 minus 6 minus 6 become the plus 6 here. Now x by 27 minus 3 24 y by 2 plus 18 20 1 by 6 plus 6 12. So x by 24 equal to y by 20 equal to 1 by 12. Now your x by 24 equal to 1 by 12. Comparing the first one and last one. x equal to 24 by 12. 12 1 ja, 12 2 ja. x equal to 2. Next, comparing the second one, last one. y by 20 equal to 1 by 12. Taking the cross multiplication. y equal to 20 by 12. So yeah, 4 5 ja, 4 3 ja y equal to 5 by 3. So, your x value to y value 5 by 3. Now, these are the x and y coordinates of the ortho center O of x comma y. So, then ortho center of triangle A, B, C is O of x comma y equal to 2 comma 5 by 3. This is your answer. This is important topic and calculations are very important. This is the homework. Do this problem and comment your answer. Thank you everyone. For more videos, please subscribe my channel and share to your friends. Thank you very much.